What's up guys, it's Gibbons here and welcome back to Pro Cycling Manager 2021 for stage number 5 of our Jura playthrough with the team DSM. Today's stage is a hilly one with a potential sprint finish in Villa Franca Tirena. Just like yesterday, this stage is not exactly the real stage we'll be riding, but the finish is exactly the same. Um, yeah, we're, we're sitting in P4 after the Etna stage. Uh, there hasn't been too much of, uh, or too many gaps on like the real stage. So yeah, we're sitting in P4 comfortably, should we say. Let's see if today could be another winning day for DSM through Kiesvel or Alberto Dainazer, or I don't know, maybe Martin Tuzvelt. Well, we may have to forget about Martin Tuzvelt or Alberto Dainazer winning because they both have negative days. Uh, but we're going to start the race with minus two today on Roman. Not too bad as uh, the Chiclamino jersey yet again of Roman. Absolutely glorious. Some would say remarkable. But I'm going to say glorious. Uh, Dan is at the front, but yeah, we'll be sprinting for Kiesvel. Well. I'm hoping he makes the um, Portela Manrazzi. I think he will. I think he will. Uh, I think if I actually take care, about, uh, take care of him, uh, unlike I do on every mountain stage, I reckon I can make this or with some attacks. Uh, I wish I could send someone in the breakaway, but I'm not exactly well placed. So hopefully, hopefully the peloton prevents everyone from attacking until uh, I get up there. And we did manage to make the breakaway. Uh, it's a group of four riders with Diego Andres Camargo, Laurence Nazen, Pierre-Luc Perichon, and ourselves with Nico Dens. Gap is two and a half minutes. Uh, I feel like we're not going to make it, uh, but it's sadly been a, a recurring theme on this draw so far. Five stages, four road ones, no breakaway so far. Crash at the back of the peloton, Attila Valta and Damien Hausen hitting the deck. Uh, tough, tough Giro for Attila, just like in real life. Uh, really struggling. When the road is going up, he's now 15 minutes behind for uh, the young Hungarian. Is FDG even running with anyone else? I mean, I guess yeah, Arno, but that's, that's basically it. Yeah, tough, uh, tough tour so far for uh, the, uh, the the Hungarish goat. Hungarish? Hungarian goat. 10k to go and I've reached this moment of the race where I don't know what I need to do because I have Nico Dent up front and I have my train. The gap is 44 seconds. So on paper, they should get like co-op. But I know that if I pay attention to Nico Dent, I'm, I'm probably going to lose. So yeah, it's it's a bit difficult. I, I never really know what to do in those situations because I know I shouldn't pace. That's Mat that's Matthew attacking. That's, that's Mathieu attacking with Rigsabel Peter Serin in... What? Okay, another thing that I, I had not anticipated in this stage, but I guess it happens as Tobias Bayer and uh, Dries de Bont have crashed for Alpesin. I think uh, the attack of Mathieu Van Depel rocked their world. 5k to go. I mean, I'm gonna follow Luc Perichon, Pierre-Luc Perichon, sorry. In the meantime, I'm gonna go 99 with them lot. Case ball is well-ish placed. I mean, yeah, no, Scrapda is not placed at all. Pierre-Luc Perichon stopped sprinting. That's very cool from you. Wow. Lovely. Simply lovely. There goes Dinosaur. Nico Dance is going to stop. This is absolutely shocking. The win today. Caleb. Caleb. Caleb, you win? He's going to get co op. I mean, people are going to catch him, but not enough. He wins ahead of Kiesbol and Phil Bowers. I have no idea what this sprint was, but I'm telling you. When there's a breakaway and I have a sprinter, I'm lost. I don't know what to do, I don't know how to act. So, yeah, it's a shame, but it's P2 nonetheless. P2 for Kiesbel, meaning that in the uh, points jersey, in the Chic Lamino, he takes the lead over Romain Bardet and new third Caleb Ewan. The GC does not change at all. It is still Joao Almeida leading ahead of Carapaz, Simon Yates and Romain Bardet. And that should not change after tomorrow's stage either. Very flat between Palmi and Scalia Riviera de Cedri. Or Cedri? Probably Cheddar, um, which will be 190 kilometers, but that will be for tomorrow's stage. So I hope you guys will be there to watch it. Absolutely massive thank you for the recent support on this series. This has been unreal. Every video is one out of 10 in my most viewed. So you guys keep rocking it, and I'm genuinely very grateful. But yeah, I'll see you tomorrow for stage number six of the Giro d'Italia. Take care. My name is Guillaume. See ya. Pass me the phone.